So this is an opportunity for you to be interviewed on TV and be positioned as the expert. Um, we're chatting with Steve Highland, who's the founder and co-founder and host of Business Connections Live. Uh, now we've been running these interviews, these guest expert interviews, in this TV studio for a while now with great success. So I wanted to bring Steve in to kind of share with us, with you, what the opportunity was and how it can benefit your business and position you as the expert so that you can go on to get more clients, connect to journalists, get more credibility and uh, position your profile. Steve, thank you so much for your time. My pleasure. So for anybody that hasn't met you before, and I know it's an, an immensely successful channel what is business connections live well business connections live has been running for five years now and our intention is to give a platform for business experts to be able to tell people that's what they are it's to position them as an expert so that we can interview them find out what they do and what lessons they've learned as they grow and develop their businesses so over the five years we've looked at everything from how to utilize and use social media so we've had social media experts who will come in and sit and talk to us how to raise funds for your business so fundraising uh, leadership we've had a lot of that uh, sales technique marketing technique and what these people do they don't come in uh, and sit down and be interviewed and it's, it's not a blatant promotion of their business what this is is showing prospective clients that they truly do know what they're talking about so it's that that's the difference it isn't just sales this is about promotion and marketing so are you really the expert and just by coming to the studio and being interviewed shows that you do know a little bit more about than anybody else and there therefore does position you as a, an industry expert brilliant and we do have we are looking to um to book some slots in for experts within the show. And not only is it a marketing piece for yourself to be able to use to send that to people, and we'll go into that in a minute, you will also be streamed on Business Connections Live. Now you're across all different channels, you go live once a week, and uh, it, it's a really successful show, isn't it? Now your show, this is slightly different, this will be up to a five minute interview, and we'll share with you what we're looking for. We're looking for a number of different experts, as Steve said, with all sorts of kind of like um, different trades, different industry, different sectors, but different skill sets like marketing, sales, or multi level marketing, we were talking about the other day, leadership, that kind of thing. Um, but your show that you run on a Monday that is live, that's up to an hour show that is massive, it is an extremely show. well, isn't it? It's four, it's four 12 minute segments. And what we do within that program, we allow our expert guests to, first of all, to position themselves. So we find out a bit about them, a little bit of their background, what their skills are. And then we invite them to share some of the, the best practice knowledge that they have over the course of the rest of the show. And then at the end of it, they get an opportunity to not pitch, but to give the key takeaways of the knowledge that they have. And, and that proves to be very, very powerful. It's a fantastic uh, selling tool for somebody to actually have really their, their business condensed into a three, four minute, small, short presentation that is key to the point. And it's actually what it's saying is that here are the key things that I know, and those key things will help your business to grow and to expand. And then there's always the opportunity to put things like calls to action on it, where we'll have web addresses and contact telephone numbers. But that is one of the most powerful tools that we've come across and it really is utilized by many of the guests who come on the program and they use it as calling cards in fact. And what we've done, we've basically taken all the good bits of what you're doing on the show that made it uh, accessible to a lot more business owners that really yes. do want to position themselves to new customers, to their prospects, to journalists to get more media coverage. So it's an actual TV invite. So, so let's talk through what the opportunity is and then we can talk about why they should consider doing it. The opportunity is then to come into your studio and you'll see the dates below uh, for a, um, a up to a five minute interview. Now that's a long time in TV. So the interview is, it's a really media friendly interview isn't it Steve? They'll be able to in advance have a prep sheet to, to kind of list the things they want to talk about. So it's really showcasing their, their business, their expertise and their own key messages. Tell us a little bit how that five minute interview works. Well, what we do, we, we first of all, we will sit them down. Now, you're dead right, five minutes uh, is longer than they'll probably get on most 
interviews if they're working with the media. But in this particular circumstance, of course, it is all about them. So it is five minutes that they can talk about um, they can talk about what they achieve and what they can offer other businesses. The first part, first question is who you are and what you do. So a very, very clear proposition. This is what we're about. And sometimes it's really good if you actually identify the issues that uh, potentially your clients or your customers have. Uh, do you want, you know, do you find it difficult to raise money for your business? Um, do you find it difficult to understand how social media works? Things like that. So proposition then we work our way through the resolution how they can help so what are the key benefits that they bring to their clients that they're talking to and then you've got the the call to action now the call to action is well what do you want them to do at the end of this now as we said it's, it's not blatant selling because i think there's too much of that goes on online at the moment but it is an opportunity to ask the people who are watching your video to actually take some form of an action and it could be as simple as downloading a free giveaway booklet or something like that so that's the fundamentals of the interview now there are other things on that where uh, it's great to include the likes of testimonials, the results that you've had with other clients, um, all those kind of things. And it just has a little bit of color, a little bit of gravitas to the message that you're trying to get across. So, so, so why TV? Why this studio? Because obviously I know that and I know the power of TV. I mean, it is so much more powerful and it, it's perceived as high cred credibility, isn't it? Well, I think it's because you can see the whites of the eyes, to be honest with you. I think, I think that's half of it. So much communication now is conveyed by our body language, the, the mere way that we, we handle ourselves, the smile on your face, the way you gesture can actually really add to the message that you're, you're presenting and to the way you're saying it. So I think that's why it adds. And also, I suppose the credibility is that that's the way the internet is going. Uh, most websites within the next couple of years anyway will look like multimedia TV channels and you've got to have those assets. They talk at the moment, they say that there are multiple days worth of content uploaded every hour to the likes of YouTube and to LinkedIn and to Facebook. The danger or the problem with some of that content is it's not very good. So what you're getting by coming in here is something that looks professional. It gives you the opportunity to position yourself as a professional and should raise you above the noise that's out there at the moment because trust me there is a lot of noise out there yeah and and it's great and and not only can they use it for their own marketing to whether they put it on linkedin on their website and i will help you you know we're looking for a number of guests to take part but we want to make sure you get the most out of this so we'll have a strategy call with you as well to find out I'll have a strategy call with you to find out what is it you're trying to achieve. So I'll give you some guidance, guidance, bearing in mind what your end in mind is. So it might be looking to promote a book for the seminar. Just tell people in general what you do, positioning yourself as the expert. We'll help you preempt that ahead of going to see Steve. And then we'll, we'll come up with a plan of how to use this video um, and to, to showcase your TV interview. But what is great as well is that you're gonna be streaming it across Business Connections Live, your yeah, platforms yeah. as well, isn't it? So it's an amazing opportunity. So it is an actual, you know, it's, it's it, you're gonna be on TV and you will be featured on Business Connections Live. And that in itself has massive gravitas, doesn't it? To share yeah. with people. It does indeed. And I think the other thing as well is not to think that it stops when it come, when you finish doing the interview. If you transcribe the page, you can repurpose it in press releases. If there's a key point within what you've said and you want to get that out on different platforms, then this is a fantastic opportunity for doing that. Uh, we had one client and what they did, they, they completely transcribed the interview that we did with them. They turned it into a booklet and also a USB stick. And they were sending that as an introduction to themselves out to their clients. Now, they saw an increase in sales by doing that and conversions because what was happening, they were landing on their client's desk with something that was a bit different. And it didn't cost a lot of money to transcribe. It was a beautiful full color booklet that they sent out. They supported it with graphics in there and it really presented their proposition to their prospective clients in a very, very powerful way. So the combination of the booklet, the combination of the USB stick, is just one way that you can utilize the content that you produce and repurpose it at a later date. And what we also want you to do is, because I'm all about connecting you to journalists, and I want you to be able to use this as your calling card to the media, to be able to show them, you know, 
you, what you look like, what you sound like, like Steve says, the white of your eyes, how you come across, what your topic is, because then the journalist can work out how they can work with you if there's a story or a debate. It's just a great way that kind of puts you above everybody else of just doing a normal introductory email or that you can say, here's a link to my video or my recent TV interview. So it's, so it's an amazing opportunity. Okay, so the way the opportunity will work is if you're interested, you can, uh, you can register. There is a small production uh, fee in in, um, that's going to be charged to you because obviously TV production costs thousands doesn't it and you'll see that this is next to nothing but obviously there is a small production fee how much does TV production normally cost Steve because well, you know, I've done it before in the past. We go back a couple of years and we talk about the old pro, um, promo videos or uh, corporate videos they were looking there at a thousand pounds a minute. Wow. So let me explain about what you've got in the studio so I'm currently sitting in in our in our studio this is actually a green screen studio uh, there are five cameras in here uh, two of them actually carry autocue on the front of them as well so i've got this camera here there's another camera over there this is the wide shot and you could be sitting in that seat it could be you that would be interviewing in our expert chair so the that's just two of the cameras there are two other cameras that are in the studio and there's one above me if we want to show off perhaps maybe a book or something that you published uh, just recently so um you, you've got that facility that's so fully lit it's a it's soundproofed uh, and it is a proper TV studio. There's a green area and we have a gallery room as well where somebody is sitting pressing all the buttons. So th this is a proper television studio. The experience alone is worth the time and the effort, I think. Uh, behind me, none of this really exists. Uh, this is all what they call green screen technology. Now, that's a technology that's been used by, by everybody at the moment, but the technology that we use here is advanced, it looks good it looks real and you know it also gives us the flexibility we've done people like vodafone done people um from a number of british gas people like that we've done a number of large corporates who wanted a specific look in the studio when they were being either interviewed or whether they were presented the camera so this is the real thing this is the real mccoy you're coming to a, a real live working television production studio you sit down and then it's over to you to get your expertise across to the audience. No, it's, it's brilliant and we've had such fantastic success and I'll come on to that in a minute. So the opportunity is there for you. We are looking for guests. So please, you know, register if you are interested sooner rather than later. And then we'll allocate uh, the timings and come back to you. We'll give you your prep sheet. We will give you a strategy call. As I say, we'll have a strategy call with us. some media training ahead that Steve will send to you so you can get prepared for it. And obviously we'll have a chat to you before as well. It's, it is an amazing opportunity. And, um, you know, we've done it before and we've had a massive uptake. So much so that it's going really well, isn't it? You know, really? how are they doing? How are the interviews coming across? What's interesting is a lot of people, when they turn up, they are a little nervous. And, but the prep sheet is, is very clear. It, it identifies what we're looking for from the prep sheet. And when they sit down in the chair, uh, they are coming over. Fantastic. Because what happens very quickly is it becomes a discussion. It, just, just, it, it doesn't feel like it. The loneliest place in the studio is 10 foot in front of the camera. That's the loneliest place. Yeah. But when we do the interviews, you, you're just talking to me and uh, I'm quite a nice chap. I don't bite. And I think, I mean, my job is to get the best out of you. Yeah. I, I'm not here to embarrass you. I'm here to make you look great. And that's what this is all about. It's yeah. giving you the best possible opportunity to position yourself as an expert in an environment that will make you look professional. And that's that's great and it's a really valid point because most interviews, the journalists will have their own objective. They'll have a reason for their, the, the, the reason why they're interviewing you. This is your objective. Your, you know, Steve will chat to you in advance and say, look, what is it you're trying to achieve out of this interview? What's your end goal? So he will make sure that he, the interview is brought round to make sure, like you say, it brings the best out of you and then you get to promote what you're trying to achieve in the end. Um, so it's it's the most media friendly interview you're going to have in the most professional Ever. setting. And it's and we've had, and you know, we'll share some of the uh, testimonial feedbacks. We've had great feedback. You're right, it is quite scary. It is quite nerve wracking. But actually, once you settle into it, all they're doing is telling us what they know anyway, naturally, is if they're talking to a prospect and a client. But what they're doing is because you're, uh, you know, you're a, you're a brilliant interview host is that you will make sure that you know what their key message is and what they're trying to get out of it so you'll make sure that the interview ends with that in mind won't you 
Yes, I will. And that really is my intention. We also do give you a little bit of background when it comes to how to handle the media as well. So that is part of your experience when you're with us. We, we run a full day media training course here for large blue chip clients. And we, we condense a bit of that down that will give you a bit of an insight into how to prepare yourself. In fact, probably that's the most important word is a bit of preparation. Don't overly prepare but prepare enough so you know what you're going to say and vocalize what you're going to say as well say it out loud and if you've got some great stories to tell turn them on their head um instead of telling once upon a time goldilocks went for a walk and then eventually met the three bears tell us that goldilocks slept the baby's bear bed and she ate his porridge and then tell us the rest of the story so turn stories on their head so you get to the point quicker now we explain all that on the day and we help you put together and construct your presentation and a lot of people say to us that they also find that that little bit of training they find that useful in their normal presentation techniques when they're going out and doing public speaking or when they're doing networking so it's a kind of a win-win situation yeah and you also want to get a lot of training that I'll, I'll be able to send you links to as well because as part of it i want to support you as much as possible so you have access for a month for free to my vip media pass which is all the online resources so we've interviewed steve already and you can see about the media training how to hold yourself how to do a tv interview you know what it looks like and there's loads of other interviews there if you're looking on get it on radio or introductory emails to journalists so that you can actually maximize this afterwards it is an amazing opportunity if you are interested please book your place sooner rather than later there are then also other opportunities that we can talk to you about afterwards and it might be simple things like the may Maybe some opportunities are coming as a guest for the show for up to an hour. So not only are your five minute interview, there might be a can't promise because I know they get booked away in advance. Mm -hmm. But also there might be ways that if you are a big corporate company and you want to have it a bit more personalized, this is in the Business Connections Live studio. You might want then look at an interview with your own logos and kind of just talk to us about that, Steve, the actual other opportunities. That well, it's, it's a fantastic vehicle, Rachel, for employee comms. Um, it's just a great way to get a core message out to your employees what we've seen in the past with some of our clients is that they will write an email or they'll they'll write a mandate that is sent out to all the employees or it'll be um, it'll be sent to senior managers and as it trickles its way down through the business it gets corrupted and, and you get this kind of Chinese whispers effect so that what is said by the senior leadership team by the time it gets to the workforce is not exactly what was said initially and, and people cherry pick bits that they feel they should pass on. Now, by coming into the studio and sitting down and presenting that very same message and then sending the message out to your workforce, well, it's effectively from the horse's mouth. They hear exactly what you want them to hear. It's a very, very powerful form of communication and it is a terrific way of engaging your workforce. Yeah, so this opportunity is for any any uh, SMEs that are working for themselves that want to position themselves as the expert or the big corporates as well, like we say, that you know have the internal comms and want to get it across. So there's lots of opportunities. So all the details are there. Um, thank you, Steve, for your time. I really do appreciate it. We've yeah. had great fun with this and we know it obviously is the way everybody's going with TV. So book your place and, and then I will be in touch with you to confirm all the dates, send your prep sheet and everything. Agree your strategy call ahead of you going to see Steve and you'll have some media training um, interviews sent to you as well so you can watch them and prepare as much as you will. Any final notes, Steve? Any final comments before we go? Don't hesitate and don't be frightened. Just do it because it will make a difference to your business and it'll make a difference to your profile. Brilliant. Thank you, guys. And thank you so much for watching. I look forward to working with you very soon. See you soon.